New at six, residents of Tiny Point Ray's station are celebrating a win that may be small in scale, but still hugely important to them. KPIX 5's John Ramos has a story. The housing crisis is happening everywhere, but in small towns like Point Reyes Station, you can't just solve it by building high-rise, high-density housing complexes. This story begins in 2014 when it was learned that this former Coast Guard housing site containing 36 townhomes was going on the auction block to be sold to the highest bidder. As a community, we said, no way. We are in a housing crisis. Those homes need to be used for the community's benefit. At Point Reyes Station, the cost of housing has skyrocketed, partially from demand for short-term vacation rentals. And with most of the open land federally protected, working-class residents are being priced out of town. So it was a big deal when, last night, the Marin County Board of Supervisors officially voted to purchase the land from the Coast Guard and give it to the town. So they have 36 townhouses that house multiple people, maybe 80 or 90 people. This is just huge for West Marin. The townhouses are in remarkable shape, with half of them turnkey ready. There are tennis courts, a picnic area, and dining hall. The only thing missing is a septic system, so a wastewater treatment facility will have to be constructed. The property will likely be owned and protected by the Community Land Trust Association of West Marin, or CLAM, which will maintain it as affordable housing. You know, in the larger urban area, 36 homes sounds like it's very small. To us, this is huge, and this is actually the biggest opportunity to create affordable homes that West Marin has ever seen. CLAM's director says it's possible that more units could be added to the land in the future, but even the 36 homes will mean a lot to residents who fear gentrification is changing the feel of the town. Having a house or something uh, stable here, it, uh, it really allows people to grow the roots in, in the community, be able to participate more and give more back. It's taken three and a half years just to complete the purchase of the property, but the county says in about 90 days they'll know what needs to be done and have a timeline for when people might be able to move in. At Point Reyes Station, John Ramos, KPIX 5. And Marin will pay $4.3 million for that 32-acre property with money coming from the county's Affordable Housing Trust Fund.